Hello and welcome to today's video. Hey guys, uh, it's Maggie Liz and welcome to today's video. So as you know, it is June, which is uh, National Pride Month. Um, I have not really 100% talked about this, like really gotten into my sexuality. Like I've mentioned in videos, like I'm bisexual and I kind of just left it at that. Um, basically for this video I'm going to be answering some questions like how did I come out, how did I find out I was bisexual, and you know, shit like that. So, basically I found out, like I kind of started discovering I was when I was in about ninth grade. Um, I kind of always knew though, like I kind of in the back of my mind was like well I kind of find girls attractive but guys at the same time <laughs> because when I was in third grade um I was hanging out with this girl and sorry I thought I heard someone um shit was going down and me and her were talking and we ended up kissing for experimenting and I kind of just thought like, okay, I really didn't mind that. <laughs> so I was like, okay, move on, like, it's probably nothing. Because at the time, I didn't know bisexual was a thing. I thought there was gay and straight. That's it. <laughs> so as I grew older, I discovered bi uh, being bisexual. And basically, ninth grade came around and... I got into a breakup with a guy I was dating and I kind of was hanging out with my friends and kind of in a jokey matter I was just like oh maybe I'll be bisexual like blah 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 <laughs> well I actually did start kind of thinking of the idea and I was just like like for the longest time I have in the back of my mind thought what if I am bisexual <laughs> So I kind of took some time to myself and kind of stayed away from people just to kind of figure out who I was and I kind of, like it didn't happen overnight. Nobody becomes gay or straight or bisexual overnight. Like they don't figure it out that like that. For me, it took a long process, and I kind of realized, okay, this is who I am, and shit, now I'm going to have to tell my parents. <laughs> um, so that comes out to my coming out story. Like, my friends already knew. I didn't even tell my parents for like a year, because I found out when I was 14. I was still going to a Christian school. I didn't want to tell anyone, except for my closest friends. So basically... I was talking to this girl who I really liked. She was smart, she was funny. Uh, she also had a kid too though. And I was ready to kind of step up and be like, okay, I can be a stepmom at 15. <laughs> um, I was ready to step up. But that didn't end well. But basically, the night we started dating, I was like, you know what? I'm just going to come out to my parents. Let's just fucking do this. <laughs> so I went up to them. I was like, I need to tell you guys something. They're like, okay, what is it? So I looked at them, and I just came out with it. I didn't be around the bush. I just came out with it. I looked at them. I said, I'm bisexual, and I'm in a relationship with a female. <laughs> And they, like, without hesitation, they looked at me just with, like, the most straight face and was just like, okay, whatever makes you happy. I was just like, wow, I was not expecting you guys to, uh, react that fast, but also that positive. 
Sorry guys, I had to move to a new location because my location got um, invaded by my family. <laughs> Alright, so, um, which is probably good because I can actually sit down because I think I'm like running a fever or something because I cannot stop sweating no matter where I am. Okay, they're sure is see-through. Sorry guys. <laughs> I don't remember exactly where we left off, but um... I know we were talking about like me coming out to my family and they basically were very accepting. There are family members of mine that I do not know. Actually, I think my parents and sister are the only family members that know. Because <laughs> I know I'm definitely not going to tell my grams who is a huge Christian who is against gays. So... I'm definitely not going to tell her anytime soon. And thank God, she doesn't even know I have a YouTube channel. <laughs> At least that I know of. Um, so yeah, I know, um, like, I don't know how, like, my Nana would react to it. Just because I don't know how she feels about all that. <laughs> but yes, um, so that is how I found out I was bisexual and I processed through it. And me coming out to my family, which when you come out to your family, don't be like me, though. <laughs> Probably give it to them lightly. Because, like, in the back of my head, I knew that they wouldn't care. So that's why I was just kind of came out with it. And I suck under pressure. But if you want to come out to your family, I would do it in a slower process. Especially if you don't know how they are going to react. Um, but yeah, so that is my entire story of being bisexual. Um, and yeah, so happy Gay Pride Month. Um, if you yourself are gay, bisexual, transgender, whatever, comment down below and tell me like your coming out story to your friends or family, like with my friends. I completely forgot to tell you guys this. Um, I literally told all of them separately, okay? Not at the same time, all separately. Their reactions were exactly the same. They all said, yeah, I know. <laughs> Every single one of them. Um, I was like, are you serious? Was I the only person who didn't know that? <laughs> um, but yeah, so comment and tell me your coming out story as bi, gay, um, transgender, or whatever you classify yourself as. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give this video a big thumbs up, smash that like button. Also, comment for suggestions on upcoming videos, because we will totally love to take your suggestions. All my social media will be down in the description, so go follow me in all those. Subscribe to my channel if you already haven't, and I will see all of you in the next video, as always. Bye, guys.